High Desert's Week 6 highlights treat local fans to home field debuts of a pair of local pitchers. Former Oak Hills Bulldog, now Yardbirds reliever, Creighton Ubedes, and 2016 Hesperia graduate, Travis Holm. Starting pitcher Travis Holm, now a coach at Oak Hills High School, these action highlights and sound bites answer queries as to whether the 22-year-old was nervous in his debut and how the sand pile-like mound contributed to his getting off to the start he had. I invited um, the I coach at Oak Hills High School, and I invited him out, and, and he told them, and it was, it was surprising to see him out there, and they were there, and they were peeking their head in the dugout, so uh, that was a lot of fun. Yeah. Now, when you're on, when you're on your game, yeah. what do we see? What are your strengths? What are my strengths? Uh, I found the zone very effectively. Uh, usually my fastball is, is on. Now uh, wait, your first four pitches last night were balls. Yes. But this is where I want to bring up the point. The mound makes a world of difference. Yes, it does. That thing was like it a does. sand pile. It really was. Um, we, we actually asked for clay last night because there's no, there was no clay. We were digging and we were digging and there was nothing. Uh, it was just, I was going farther and farther down every single time. So uh, it does make a difference, especially uh, later in the game. Uh, it'll be, you know, if, if your landing gets lower and lower, uh, you have to kind of change your slots. So, uh, so that was different. So that was, I had to get used to that. Uh. Week six home field highlights include Kent Blackstone's first Atalanto Stadium home run. Kent Blackstone has contributed steadily, being relied upon by manager Sip Garza to hit from anywhere in the top of the batting order, from leadoff to second to cleanup on occasion. Shane Brown rips his sixth home run of the season. This is in his first game back after being sidelined when hit by a pitch in a loss at Bakersfield. We also witness continuous contributions by Bradley Harmon, including a four RBI game against the Ridoso Osos Grizzlies. That four runs driven in performance brings Bradley Harmon's RBI total to 20. It was the Grizzlies fans cheering loudest the first two games against the visitors, a traveling team based in Redoso Osos, New Mexico. Week six of the Yardbirds 2018 campaign includes a stretch of seven games in four days, thanks to back-to-back -back doubleheaders in Tucson and a third twin bill at Atalanto Stadium. Contests contributing to the longest losing streak in franchise history. The skid was stopped by Adolfo Espinosa's win over Monterey, a Tuesday night triumph energized by PA announcer Crazy Chris Ackerman's 50th birthday party. The voice of the Yardbirds brought with him hordes of loyal fans and followers who were delighted by the pie-in-the-face prelude to singing Happy Birthday. Also introduced in this homestand, well, it's not Disco Duck, but, well, Rowdy in the Press Box, Strobe Light, Rally Cry. The homestand continues through the July 4th Fireworks Extravaganza. High Desert Sports Training's online sports report. High Desert Sports Training, the area's only high-performance TreadX 3030 treadmill and hip machine. Indoor batting cages. High Desert Sports Training utilizes muscle memory and speed of contraction, developing a quicker, faster, and stronger athlete. Call to schedule a free evaluation. High Desert Sports Training.